kids and welcome to another Baby Time Online from the Pflugerville Public Library. Today, we're going to learn about the letter L. But first, let's sing our good morning song. Remember, we use some sign language with this song. We use more, together, happy, and friends. All right, let's begin. Oh, the more we get together, 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 oh, the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Cause your friends are my friends, and my friends are your friends. Oh, the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Oh, the more we get together, together, together. Oh, the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Cause your friends are my friends, and my friends are your friends. Oh, the more we get together, the happier we'll be. All right, friends. So today we're going to talk about the letter L. What kinds of words start with the letter L? Let's see. There's lollipops, and love, and lions, and llamas, llamas, if you say it with a Spanish accent, lobsters, and even little, like little, right? All those start with the letter L. All right, friends, our book today is How to Hide a Lion by Helen Stevens. And we're reading this with kind permission of Macmillan's Kids Press. How to Hide a Lion. One hot day, a lion strolled into town to buy a hat. But the townspeople were scared of lions, so the lion ran away. He ran as fast and as far as he could and hid in a house in a garden. It was a playhouse and it belonged to a small girl called Iris. You can't hide there, said Iris, who wasn't scared of lions. That house is too small for you. They went inside so Iris could hide the lion properly. They had to be quiet because moms and dads can be funny about having a lion in the house. The lion let Iris comb the leaves out of his mane and he showed her his paw where he had stepped on something sharp. I'll put a bandage on that, said Iris. It wasn't easy hiding a lion. He was just too big, too fluffy, and too heavy, especially when he was asleep. And lions sleep a lot. But when no one was looking, the lion could come out and to play. They just had to be careful not to be too noisy. One evening, Iris's dad said, they still haven't found that lion. I bet he's a kind lion, said Iris from behind the sofa. There's no such thing as a kind lion, said her mom. All lions will eat you. The lion was worried, but Iris comforted him. Then she read him his favorite story. It was about a tiger who came to tea. He fell asleep halfway through because lions sleep a lot. And that was when everything went wrong. Iris heard her mom coming up the stairs, but she found it's hard to wake a sleeping lion. However, most lions will wake up if a mom screams at them. Ah! <gasps> the lion raced out of the house and found a hiding place where he could still see Iris whenever she came into town. Nobody noticed him, not the townspeople, not even Iris, and certainly not the two burglars who broke into the town hall and stole every single one of the mayor's candlesticks. But the lion noticed them. With a huge roar, he leapt off his pedestal and stood on both the burglars until the police came. All the townspeople were amazed, except for Iris, who said, I told you he was a kind lion. 
Now the lion was a hero. He didn't have to hide anymore. The townspeople held a special parade for him. The mayor said he could have anything he wanted. The lion thought for a moment, then he asked for a hat, which was all he'd come to town for in the first place. It really suits you, says Iris. The end. All right, friends, we're gonna do a little action rhyme today since we're talking about the letter L and we're gonna do two little blackbirds sitting on a hill. Get your blackbirds out. Two little blackbirds sitting on a hill. One named Jack and one named Jill. Fly away, Jack. Fly away, Jill. Come back, Jack. Come back, Jill. Two little blackbirds sitting on a hill. One named Jack and one named Jill. Yay! All right, our sign language word for today is lion. Now, to make the sign for lion, you're gonna make your hand like a lion's claw or paw, and you're gonna go, Lion, just like with a big lion's mane, right? Lion, and that's the sign for lion. All right, now we got a little story here called Five Little Lions. One little lion roaring at the zoo called for another, roar, and then there were two. Two little lions underneath a tree called for another rawr, rawr, and then there were three. Three little lions who heard a distant roar called for another rawr, 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 and then there were four. Four little lions happy and alive called for another rawr, 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 and then there were five. Five little lions, roar, 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 ran off to play, and then there were no more. All right, friends, today we talked about the letter L, and we talked about lions, and other things that start with the letter L, like lobsters and little and love, and after story time, baby time, you can go around your house and see what else you can find that starts with the letter L. All right, that's all we have time for today, friends. So let's say goodbye until next time. Goodbye, goodbye, we'll see you soon. See you soon, see you soon. Goodbye, goodbye, we'll see you soon on another day. Goodbye, friends. Oh,